In this video, we're going to create a spline chart in Chart.js 4. So to do this, the first thing what we need to do here is get the boiler template, which you can find here on chartjs3.com getting started. Once you're on here, scroll down and copy this chunk of code and you're good to go. If you want to get the source code of this video and many others, check out my Patreon page. And of course, got a question, put it on Discord. All the links are in the description box. So what I want to do here now is convert this into a line chart. So we go down here, say line, and then if we save this, refresh, you can see here now we get a basic line chart here, but we want to convert it into a spline chart, which basically means a curved line. So to make it a spline chart, we're going to say comma, and then we're going to say a tension, and we can put in here the tension. The default tension, if I'm not mistaken, is zero. If I save this, refresh, you can see nothing happens. If I put it into a more nicer curve or arc, we can say here 0 0.4, and as you can see here, that works more better. We can increase this even by making it more elastic or even weaker tension on the elastic. And as you can see here, it starts to give a very weird shape. You can go very extreme by one. You can see this doesn't make sense at all. However, somewhere between 0 0.4 and 0 0.3 would probably be the best value. And that's how you create a spline chart.